GSAT-7A is an advanced military communications satellite meant primarily for the Indian Air Force with Indian Army using 30% of capacity. Topic overview GSAT-7A will enable IAF to interlink different ground radar stations, ground airbase, aircraft-to-aircraft real-time control system, airborne early warning and control AWACS aircraft such as Bereav A-50 Falcon and DRDO AEW and CS. The satellite will enhance network-centric warfare capabilities of the Indian Air Force and therefore enhance its global operations. The satellite will also be used by Indian Army's Aviation Corps for its real-time control and communication system for the helicopters and UAVs operations. India is in the process of acquiring high-altitude and long-endurance satellite-controlled UAVs, such as American Armed Predator B or Sea Guardian drones, that can fire at enemy targets from long distances. As of December 2018, there are 320 dual-use or dedicated military satellite in the sky, half of which are owned by USA alone, followed by Russia, China and India 14. To boost its network-centric operations, the IAF is also likely to get another satellite GSAT-7C within a few years. The GSAT-7A, with a mission life of eight years, is also equipped with the payload of 10 Ku band transponders, which offers several advantages over C-band, such more powerful satellite uplink and downlink signals, smaller antennas, and non-interference of communication signals with terrestrial microwave systems. Payload, 10 channels in Ku band with switchable frequency for mobile users, 4 steerable antennas 1 fixed Gregorian antenna. Topic. Launch GSAT-7A weighing 2,250 kilograms (4,960 pounds) was successfully launched on the 19th of December 2018 by GSLV Mk2 F11 rocket from second launch pad of Satish Dhawan Space Center. This three-stage launch vehicle, 51 meters tall, has a lift-off mass of about 421 tons and indigenously developed cryogenic stage. Topic. See also GSAT-7 GSAT Indian National Satellite System Integrated Space Cell List of Indian Satellites